must have had his reasons. How any man could run away from that? Sorry, I acted the way I did. Oh, forget it. I was afraid you were from the county. And I wasn't going to let anybody put my brother and sisters on the poor farm. Of course not. I'd fight anybody for them. I think I would too, Sally. That's just what I want to do. Let me stay here and, and try to get you straightened out. You can't fight the world alone. I might be able to do you all a lot of good. What do you say? All right. Good. Put to bed, too. Why, darling, of course we put you to bed. <laughs> Does Pelgrim use all that water? Yeah, that's his pump house over there. He shut us off last year. This is our old sluice. Pelgrim broke it, and Ma went to town to see a lawyer, but she didn't have enough money to fight it out. We won't need any money to fix this. All we need is a little time and some lumber. We'll build a new sluice. All right, we'll see what'll happen. Well, that's a good idea. I think I will. Hey, wait a minute, Gladden. Maybe we can get together on this. Have you got the right to speak to these kids? Yes, I think I have. Of course, your place is all run down, but I'm willing to buy it at the right price. What's your proposition? Jim, we don't want to sell. This is our ranch. I know, Pete. Mother wrote it on a piece of paper. But if you can get a lot of money for it, why, why not? Yeah, but she told us to keep it. You wouldn't make a sell, would you, Jim? If you're the guardian, you don't need this boy's consent. I'll give you 5,000 cash. No, I'm sorry. It's not on the market. I don't believe you got the right to speak for them. But I am going to find out. Come on, Junior. We're going to get ready and go to town. Hey, Jim, can they do anything? I don't think so. We'll go to town and find out. All of us? No, we we'll leave the girls at home. Come on. Get out, please! 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 Come here! We can't get a bus, Sally! Oh, I'll get him up. Get away. Pete and I are going. Oh. Well, I didn't want to go anyway. You can go. Nope. I don't want to go. We want to go to the camp. Then we want to go to the <laughs> All right. I'll tell you. We'll all go to town, huh? Yeah. All right. Come on, Sally. <laughs> nope. All right, Lily. Come on, Nancy. Charlie, jump in. Well, I suppose someone better be along to take care of Nancy and Lily. Sure. All right, Pete. Get up, Queenie. Thank you. 
Did you lose him, huh? <laughs> Take a look at that mule. <laughs> 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 Oh, you're going to laugh now after laying right down there in the middle of the street. Yeah, laugh. Go on. Oh, I'm disgusted. You think he'll stand there, Pete? Yeah, he'll stand there. Come on, let's go into the drugstore. Here we are. We'll get the sodas in here. Hey, is there a doctor here? Yes, we have Dr. Davis right back there. Uh, come on, Pete. Tie the soda later. Come on with me. Two ice cream cones. Oh, is this Dr. Davis? Yes. Hey, Doctor, this boy's got some rock salt in his arm here. Mm. What if you can take care of that? Oh, of course. Come right in here, oh, son. Uh, oh, say, Doctor, is there a lawyer around here? Anyone? Lawyer? Yes, yes Mr. Uh, Hanson is a very good one. His office is right upstairs. Just over the store. Yeah. All right, thank you. Right ahead, Pete. I come won't on, be long. Go ahead. I say, sure. give the uh, kids all they want. I like chocolate candy. And you me do. too. Well, Sharpton, you shall have this. Here, Sally, you pay for this. I'm going to see Mr. Hanson upstairs. I won't be long. Okay. I want a nice ice cream cone, too. Me what? too. <laughs> all right. Hurting you, son? Oh, no, that don't hurt me. 